you ever been that guy that when an entire crowd is shuffling in the same direction, you have to go the opposite? Like the time the football game is over and the crowd is moving as one mass to the door. You could not even move your feet and you would somehow be pushed out of the stadium along with the crowd. But there are those times when everyone is rushing to the door and you're the one trying to wiggle your way to the bathroom. Walking against the flow of the crowd is never easy or fun, but it can be done. When you are that guy, how do you walk? Do you puff your chest out, make your shoulders as broad as possible, and forcefully march with both elbows swinging? Personally, I sure hope not. You usually slouch and slither through the small openings, trying to get to where you are going without being noticed or causing a fight. When we choose to move against the crowd, how can we do so without being intimidated by the mass that pushes against us? Our reward is our destination in the end, but how can we push through with our shoulders back, chin up, and not worry about the ripples we may create because we are confident in our path? By reading the Beatitudes again and taking notice of a word that is repeated nine times but is easily overlooked. Blessed. Jesus simply states that blessed are the people in the kingdom of heaven. No, not simply at all. Do you understand the magnitude of the word blessed? We can never fully understand the greatness of being blessed by God, but if we come close, then walking against the crowd would become the greatest honor. What can God's blessing do? For a friend of mine, God's blessing tells her that she is enough. She's a hardworking student who works in more organizations than I can keep track of. She's the most giving person I know. She never asks for anything else from anyone else, but is the first person people go to because she always gives. She's an amazing student, leader, and friend. And when all of her hard work and good deeds go unnoticed and sometimes unappreciated, God's blessing tells her that God sees her hard work and her pure heart. She is blessed by an all-seeing Father who loves her unconditionally. God sees her pure heart and tells her she is blessed. 